guys. We just made it here at our uh, delivery. ID. Well, I was going to just the sign because it's a bill of late. There ain't really no bill of late just to protect me. Oh, so obviously, can use sign there. Huh? Not the bill? Used to be for y'all, but not for me. They help me out. All right, back to the Hello, ma'am. Good morning. Give me one moment. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got an appointment here at 8 in the morning. I'm sorry? 8, uh, a delivery. You're picking up? Delivery. You're delivering? Yeah. All right, let me see. Uh, seven seven three. Seven seven three. Yeah. Seven. Uh, hold on. Seven seven three five eight seven. Thank you. 
Give me a moment. I'm trying oh, to Oh, no problem. Door, so Take your time. No worries. Thank you. Okay, so I gotta disconnect, right? Yes. Okay, and I can stay there just in front of it. Yes. Okay, 128? Yes, 128. Alright, appreciate it, thank you. Alright guys, back in 128. Probably all the way back there in the back of this building. This is nice facility here. It's got a wider space for backing. So my next uh, pickup is only a mile away from here. So no, it's. Yeah, it is. It is a one mile away from here, our next pickup. And that load that's gonna go to Chicago. Hopefully we're gonna get. Uh, hopefully we're gonna get unloaded here quick because our next appointment for pickup is nine in the morning or nine thirty. Well, it's okay to be late there. Uh, I've been there a few times at that location, and that's a good place to pick up too. And um, people there are really friendly, so it don't matter if you're gonna get late as for as long as it's not like three hours late, you know. right here 128 what the heck why somebody left a trailer here in the middle of uh, Swift there we go <laughs> All right, one twenty eight is right here. One twenty eight. Okay, it's pulling out. Okay. 
128 is right here. It's gonna make a U-turn, guys. I can do the blind spot, but that is not safe to do so. And I mean, you can do it if you don't have a choice, but man, you got all the space here, so gonna take a chance. Safe by choice.
Okay, we're settled down. I gotta disconnect my uh, tractor uh, from the trailer for policy. I'm just gonna make another coffee here, guys. I got a Filipino coffee here. Oops, what's going on? Oh, shit. Got a hole in it. this from here guys and I'll talk to you guys later here in Brasilton, Georgia today and we have to go to the scale to scale this load because we are over 30, 43,000 pounds I had a previous vlog about uh, this truck stop here um, yeah it's the same load that I got last week uh, it's coming back to Chicago Ford so it is almost 44,000 pounds so this is the closest truck stop I that we have here yeah and uh, this truck stop is again <laughs> this is not a good place for rookie drivers because this is very small really busy really crowded and I would imagine how tough it is for a new driver dealing with this uh, crowded and busy truck stop um, everybody is most of the reserved parking here most of the parking here are reserved parking and if you fuel when you fuel you wouldn't have enough space to you know pull forward so you have you have to stay in the, the fuel island in order for you to get your fuel receipts or if you're gonna go scale um, you don't know where to go unless if there's a spot to park then um, then you can park um, I've been here about 15 minutes now and I'm still waiting here to get through because it's really really busy here right now so this is how you deal every day I hate picking up a load uh, I hate picking up a heavy load because you have to deal with scaling it
this way. Truck number? 137. Move forward. Thanks. Now we have to find parking, guys. Because we cannot you cannot stay on the scale and get your scale ticket. You cannot do that. Everyone's going to get mad at you. Look at this. Uh, see? Amazon is trying to exit. And then this truck is pulling in in the wrong side. There is no exit here, bro. I don't know where he's going to go. That's why I don't like this truck stop. There, there is no exit here. I'm just gonna get the skill ticket, that's all I need, but I'm just hoping we can find a parking here right now because I don't know how to deal with this. scale ticket that's all we need okay uh. well it's gonna run fast You're not gonna like this truck stop guys if you're here if you're trying to park here and get your skill ticket you're gonna be stuck hello i need to get, get the skill ticket skill ticket yeah truck 137 the trailer number? Uh, trailer number is... I uh, forgot. 1140. Okay. 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 Uh, can I get a pack of BLK Smooth? Alright, thank yep. you. Thank you, sir. Thank God. I get the skill ticket now. So I have adjusted my tandem, guys, because we're a little bit heavy on the trailer. I adjusted it when I was there, and we're good right now. We don't have to rescale because everything is good so far. So thankfully we don't have to rescale this load everything is okay I'm a little bit heavy on drive axle trailer is 
No, I'm more heavy on drive. Third axle is only 31,000 pounds. Good. Okay, gotta put this charger. Yeah, that guy, he, he scaled the load too, so he's gonna take my spot there because there's no way he can find a parking to get his scale ticket because all of it here, it's, it's the parking spot are full. I mean, there is some, there is some uh, spot here, but you wouldn't have to deal all that just to get your skill ticket, you know what I mean? I mean, if you don't have the option, then you have to, but you're gonna deal with that. Because here, this is really tight. Okay, where's it gonna go? Okay. I need Red Bull. I need water. I'm thirsty now. See that truck right here it's probably parked there for a quick break maybe he has to get his skill ticket maybe he maybe he needs to buy something so you just gotta do your own own way you know you just gotta do your own thing See that? <laughs> All the line is from here by the freeway. Just going into the truck stop, you have to wait. Johnson City 